guys, welcome back to Darking Designs. Today I'm going to talk to you about doing a two page spread um, for every single chapter. This is actually something most of you probably already figured out. Um, I have shown you guys the workaround to do the ones that only land on the opposite on the on the opposite page um, or the uh, or the odd page. Um, and I do that for a reason because a lot of us write really big books with a lot of chapters and the more chapters you have, um, the more blank pages that are going to get added to your book if you do the two page spread on every single page. Because um, what it does is if the chapter lands on an even page, um, it will push that chapter to the next odd page um, so that there's an even and an odd page um, together which will add a blank page behind your even page where your chapter starts. And I'll show you what that looks like. Um, so we're going to first come in here and we're going to go to this little double um, and look at infinity thing. And we're going to go to artisanal. We're going to go to heading background. So normally this is going to look like this. You have a lot of little options. This is a one page spread, one page, two page, two page. These are ones that are already in there um, for you to use, but you can create a custom one. So we're going to, if we're doing the two page spread, you're going to want to use full bleed. And then the two page span is going to tell you the exact um, pixels that it needs to be in to fill the available area. I'm going to do a dark background. So I'm going to do use white text and I'm going to um, click on the plus button here. And we're going to go to our first one. And then I'm going to go to my first chapter here. And it's going to show me that. All right. So what I'm looking for real quick, because it will pass over them, is I'm looking for one. I hate it when it does that. So anyone that ends on a even page, all of these ones here that end on an even page, 22, 23, 24, 25, these all have blank pages in them. And you'll see that when you print it out. Um, so it'll have, let's see if it takes too long. Too long, I'll show you another one. Um, let's see. So it will look like this. So this is naturally a blank page. I insert this images into some of my clients' books if they want. Um, and I create this page for them for their book so that they're not like clients aren't stuck with just a blank page there. Um, that is, that is what it looks like. Um, and so that will be, that will end up being a blank page in your book. So right now without, forever to find that. Um, so right now, if we applied this to every single chapter, um, we'll have, I'd say 276 pages. Okay, so that's what this applied to every single chapter. Um, that is there. So we have that. Now I'm going to show you real quick how to add um, individual chapters. So say you have two or more POVs and you want to have it for different points of view. You go to individual, you come down here where it says all chapters and go to individual elements, name that element. And then below it, go to use multiple backgrounds in chapters, add background. And then you're just going to do the same thing and you're going to add that other background. I'm going to just pick a random one. It's not going to fit, but that's okay. And you're going to do individual elements and you're going to keep doing that for as many as you want. It's very important that you select the individual elements. Otherwise it will apply it to every single um, chapter and it won't give you the option to change. So we're gonna come in here to chapter one and we're gonna go up to this here, which is that little tool. And we're gonna to go to heading background and we're gonna choose what heading we want on there. 
um, or you can choose no background. Either one works. And that is how you add multiple two page backgrounds or even the one page ones um, to your book. So I'm going to delete these. And we're going to come up here and we're going to take a look at how many pages there are. So we had 276. Now we're at 250. So 26 out of 27 chapters have that blank page. That is 26 extra pages that will be added to your book and will be you will be charged for it. Um, so just keep that in mind that it will cost more to do the two page spread with everything. So if you have 40 plus chapters, 30 plus chapters, you might want to think about doing the workaround or just doing a one page spread instead of doing a two page spread. But that's just my personal opinion. You are not required to take it. And I, of course, will still read your book, even if it's like that, um, because that is perfectly okay. It's just from a marketing standpoint and from like a business standpoint, you just want to take a look at it. Um, all right. So that is it. This one was a super short video. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out in the comments below or at any time on social media at Joe McCall author or at Dark Ink Publication. Have a good night. Stay savvy.